Today, we're having a $25 versus $250 budget fishing challenge. Fletcher is gonna get $25, and your boy Noah is gonna get $250. Each contestant must use their budget on a rod, a reel, and five baits. This challenge is made up of three different contests. Whoever wins two out of the three contests wins the challenge. All right, Fletcher, you're gonna get $25, Ooh, brother. $25, he's you balling on the, a budget. You couldn't give me the 250, man? Maybe next time, maybe. I'm like, these, these rods are looking a little spicier than what I'm gonna have to work with today, but since I got a $25 budget, that is gonna be leaving me with very limited rods on the, the rod and reel side of things. Before we get deeper into this video, only 27% of y'all watching these videos are actually subscribed. So if you could take the time, hit the subscribe button, it really helps the channel, I'd appreciate it. So we basically have two options and that is gonna be either one of these kitty rods, uh, which I think these are like 15 bucks a piece, or this tangled red combo, which I think a $10 combo with the line and everything, or we'll deal with this in a second, but it's between those two things. What if about I, this one? What about the Zepco? The Zepco? I mean, dude, maybe if this was like a $50 versus $500, I could go with this, this little guy. This is the world's smallest fishing rod right here. This thing actually surprisingly works. I've caught a four and a half pound bass on this fishing rod, so. Better watch out, son. Hey man, I'm worried. But I do need to leave room for my baits, so I think this is gonna be my best option for our budget today, just because I'm gonna have a little bit more room to work with. Let me get all this untangled. You're you know, a mess, dude. How did you even do that? <laughs> dude, you probably <laughs> backlashed you it last time you used it. Noah oh. likes to just break and that use all true. my stuff. That is not true, that is not true. I'm sending him an invoice for like the last boys. four years soon. I love to use all of his stuff. I don't know about break, even though I lost one of his homemade lures the other day. I think he's taking it a little I, personal. I know. <laughs> out of all the, out of the four years I've known Noah, I've probably given him two to three thousand dollars worth of tackle from rods. I was gonna say like five, so I guess that's. <laughs> it's probably it's probably like 5, closer 000. to the five. You know yeah. what I've got in return? One KTB kicking combo. <laughs> One. It, well, it's gonna be two after this week, Fletcher. I promise I'll give you a brand new one fresh out the box. All right, Fletcher, what are you using for the baits, man? So five lures. Baits, we got. 15 bucks to work with. I definitely want to try to get some moving baits in here. Fall is around the corner. It's like kind of that transition area. You know, we just have random boxes of things all over the place. I really kind of need to do some searching to find a lure that I can afford. Considering I gotta get five of them. Are you gonna try to do the whole discounted thing like last time? I, he was like pulling individual worms. He was like pulling a worm out of this bag and crawl out of this bag. I made a, a, a multi-pack. I mean, that's gonna be an option. I wanna try to find some moving baits though. If I can get like two moving baits and then make me a little like little combo pack for five bucks. I like that. Fall time, fish chewing up on some bait. Ooh. Uh, that's really what you need. Okay. All right, I got some combo packs in mind. Okay. I got some what combo got? packs. Give me these. Give me this Rage Swimmer right here. Ooh. That's probably six bucks. Uh, it's like a six dollar pack, but if we take just one. It's a dollar. Two baits. Is this a dollar right here? Okay, that's fair. That's a fair. Dollar, that's a dollar. A dollar for two soft plastics. Then we need a jig head. This one's looking a little old and crusty. Can I get 25 cents on this? Yeah, 25 cents. <laughs> you can drop a quarter on it. I can drop, drop a quarter. <laughs> 25 cents on this old rusty little uh, fish head. That's fair. So that's, fair. that's bait number one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Boy. We got a beetle spin. <laughs> we got some beetle spin little, little things. Can I can I have it with this? For yeah, that's fine. Uh, what, what, what's this going to run me? I'm thinking about a dollar, man. A dollar? Actually, actually uh, two bucks. Two, two bucks. bucks? Okay, okay, so you got two dollars, three dollars, three dollar fifty cents, okay? So I'm at 18. So you got approximately? 13 bucks. Okay, That's yeah. Spent. 13 spent. Yeah. 12 oh, bucks, Fletchy. Come on now. Um, can I get a used discount? 
<laughs> let's let's see what, what you got here, <laughs> bro. This is a jackhammer, is it not? Oh no, that's no, a thunder. Yeah, I was about to say jackhammers are like twenty bucks, bro. Can I get the used discount? Five bucks, Fletcher. Five bucks? Ooh, I got the I got that Goodwill special. This little setup, we have a used and abused crawl with a bent uh, hook. I think I can make some repairs. Can I get this and one extra crawl? One extra crawl for. A dollar fifty. I was gonna say two bucks. Two bucks. I mean, it's your call. It's Here's... two bucks. That's your fourth bait, and then yeah, I mean, two bucks. Can we meet at one seventy-five? <sighs> we'll meet halfway. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's that, a deal. that was a good bargain. Yes, Thank sir. you, sir. Thank you, sir. So let me find a crawl to put. Why am I like the auctioneer of this video, <laughs> man? <laughs> I'm just making the prices up. I kind of like it though. I need an actual cash register though. So next video, if you guys want to see a cash register, we need to go to a pawn shop fletch and get one of those like old cash registers. Type her oh. on up, you know? <laughs> so there is my extra crawl. That's gonna be part of my little combo pack. So we got four baits, we need one more. If I could get like a crank bait, we got like a little KVD 1.5. Boom. Money, money. I like it. Five I bucks. I like it, dude. Yeah, five bucks. You got the deal. We got our five lures. We got our cheap rod, and we're about to hand it to this boy well, with the Mac Daddy budget. Thank you for coming to uh, Fletcher's Tackle Shop. I You're appreciate welcome. the business and your twenty-five dollars. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna use that on my budget, so now I get uh, two hundred and seventy-five dollars. Thank you for <laughs> letting me purchase the items I already own. I know. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a good deal. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> All right, boys, now we go in with the 250 budget. First things first, we have to go with a rod. That's gonna be the heftiest spender out of my items. So I need a rod and I need five baits. I could possibly get more baits because I'm balling. So we can go a little fancier. You know, Fletcher was over here around the budget bin. I don't know if we'll do that today, but let's go ahead and walk over here to this little rod holder that we got. And uh, we got a bunch of different options. Fletcher, how, matter of fact, I might go with two rods, man. <laughs> how, how much is this <laughs> You want the 100 year old combo? Dude, I could knock somebody out with this thing. It's actually I very mean, hefty. This originally retailed, I think $25, but adjusted for inflation over 100 years, we're looking at about 275. Like two dollars and seventy-five cents. Two hundred seventy-five. You're crazy, Clark. You're crazy. <laughs> Not doing that. All right, we got some spinning rods. We got some nice ones. But the, to be honest, like I don't even know if I want to go with a spinning rod. I want something that I'm comfortable with. I want to go with a bait caster. What Fletcher was saying, you know, this time of year. Fish are chewing up on bait fish. We're gonna be throwing a lot of moving bait. So with that being said, probably not the spinning rod. So let's go ahead and walk. There's a couple bait casters there. We got a mock two. The problem I have with that is that it's left hand and I am not left handed. We got a bunch of different options over here. We have a mock crush, but I believe this might be too expensive. That's like 200 and something dollars. Yeah, that one's, I That's think it's 280. Yeah, yeah, okay, it's, yeah, it's not, not even a picture. Okay, not even a picture. I mean, not, you not go, even a picture. You go, you go with a Zebco. I mean, if you're feeling it. I mean, why? I mean, we already know you're going with the KTV. We, going, <laughs> we going with the kicking the combo, best right? In the business. Oh my god! Unless I broke it there. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, this is a 150 bucks kicking combo. You guys can check them out on kickingtheirbass.com. I appreciate everybody for the love and support. You know, co-partner with Lose on this. And uh, this is just an awesome rod. One is great for the price. One it casts far as heck. I've seen an outcast $500 reels. I have been blown away since he released this thing and being able to use it beforehand. This thing has been phenomenal. Like it casts a mile. I've let a ton of people use it. Uh, you know, fans, friends, all that. And everybody can't believe that it's only 150 bucks. So it's a good bang for your buck. So that's definitely what I'm going with. I know I'm not on like a short budget, but like honestly, it's perfect for this. 250 bucks. Pay 150 for the rod. We got $100 in baits, bro. I think I can choose more than five if I really wanted to. And that might be a good thing for us today because think about it. If I had five baits and they're just not biting one of the baits, I can always switch up to another one, man. That might that is, come in handy. You that know? is an option. You know? So let's go over here to the bait section. So I'm thinking definitely a square bill. I mean, the fish are just chewing up on Yo, chat. These, these liplesses are some weird colors, Fletch. I love red, but I just don't know about that right now. <laughs> yeah, these are like, oh my gosh. Dude, I thought I was you gonna... break it, you buy it, man. Just... Come on. Well, here we got Strike King 2 Tap, <laughs> Catches Giants. I actually caught a lot of big ones. And one of the last episodes, you guys need to go check it out, but this thing's been killing it. 
This is one of my favorite fall time baits, so I have to go with a lipless here. And the perch color. It's called Sugar Daddy. Sugar Daddy. <laughs> Sugar Daddy. That's what I am over here. All right, we got that. We're definitely gonna go with a KVD 1.5. This is just in what it looks like. Just a standard like bluegill color. Yeah, it's called bluegill. Bluegill. You got Sugar Daddy and then you got bluegill. Blue I don't, two polar opposites of names there. But there we go, two baits right there. Let's see what else we got, man. Do you have any jig heads flush like swim bait heads? Uh, they're around here somewhere. You're gonna have to do some digging because I mean, you probably have used 90% of them. Probably. <laughs> we got right here, just paddle tail swim bait, pretty basic. That's a good natural color. This one's actually, yeah, it's a sexy shad. It's got a little blue tint to it. That's, that's fire, bro. I probably could have took your used pack, but you know, I just got too much money. Yeah, too much, money too much to spend. money's spent. Yeah. What are you looking for? You looking for? I'm looking for anything and everything. I'm going with a spinner bait, man. What you think about that, Fletch? Look at that. It's got a trailer hook and Ooh, everything. Ooh, that's fancy. Do you want an old sluggo? What is a sluggo? You know, you don't know what a sluggo is. No, what is a sluggo, bro? Dude, oh, that's a space. that's an OG bait. Mr. Twister. <laughs> Mr. Twister on the beat. <laughs> chooka, 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 chooka. We'll just set them right there. Oh, you do got swim bait heads, Fletch. Look at this. They're a little hefty. A little hefty. For what are those? Like half ounce? Quarter ounce, those aren't bad. Quarter ounce, okay. Yeah, that's, that's cool. So we're gonna get some little swim bait heads. Just so we have them with our swim baits. What is that? One, two, three, four, five, five baits. As far as the baits go, like if your moving bait bite is just not on today for some magical reason, what do you do? Uh, <laughs> cry. <laughs> so I, I wanna like stay in a good spot. So I think I'm probably gonna go with, I wish there were rage curls cause that's definitely my bread and butter, but. I don't... No, no rage crawls. We're just gonna go with these uh, ultra wide speed crawls. That's one of my favorites too. That's sick. We'll grab some hooks and weights here at the end. But I kinda wanna grab a couple more moving baits, Fletch. Let's Dude, see. I know what you need. I need a chatter dunk, bro. I wanna gift you this rat. You can have it for $50. $50, bucks, dude, you're crazy. <laughs> you're crazy, Fletch. I, I don't know how to, no. Look at this, Fletch. I had to go with the chatter dong. That would just be illegal if I didn't. Now you're copying me. Listen, dude. <laughs> I'm actually going with two chatter dongs. Two this one doesn't even have a skirt. That's considered a different bait, right? Technically, yes. Technically, yes. Technically, yes. I don't know, we'll see. Maybe we won't even use both of those, but we're gonna throw a couple of those in the mix. And then lastly, Fletcher, do you have like a trap box? You got, you got a little trap house box? Yeah, dude, I got, I got a trap for you. Hold on. Bro, that is <laughs> insane. Have you actually caught a fish on that? <laughs> yeah. That is ridiculous, man. Just hold up a regular size trap for that. Well, I bought one over here. Hold on. Yeah, go, go get your sugar daddy. Oh, my sugar daddy. Dude, that is ridiculous, bro. That, that's how you catch the bigs. That's pretty crazy, man. We'll see. I was like, that lure was, was actually $25, so if you want it. This that, one was? Yeah, that one was actually $25, but I'll give you the used discount for $17. To be honest, I think I can still buy it. I can still buy this and I want one other trap. <laughs> okay. All right, I want a normal <laughs> trap. You have like a normal color. I got sugar like daddy, color. but I want like something special. I got these, I got some hybrid hunters. You want a hybrid hunter? That's a little spicy. A hybrid hunter? Hybrid hunter. Oh, a hybrid hunter. This little white guy right here. Oh. It's oh. Yes, sir. A little L bill. Okay, I'll take that. That's actually a pretty cool color, man. Looks slick. Okay, guys, I think that is all that we're going to pick out for my budget. I got the $250. Oh, Fletchy's got the $25. Now we're going to catch y'all at the pond and we're about to smoke these fish. So let's get it. I'm going to smoke this boy. <laughs> All right, boys and girls, ladies and gents, what's going on, Fletchy? Doing good, getting my, my GoPro bra all ready to go. And now it's time to get down to business. Yes, ma'am. Okay, boys. Yes, ma'am. Yes, uh, ma'am. I got a whole cardboard box full of goodies, $100 worth of goodies, and uh, we got to decide what we want to use. To be honest, boys, I think I'm going to go on the edge. I haven't found a square bill in a while and start off with this KVD. 1.5 square bill and this is in bluegill color so there's a lot of bluegill in this pond and i can only assume that this bait's gonna work really well so this 1.5 actually dives three to five foot so i think it's gonna be perfect for this pond and we're gonna get it started as far as water clarity goes it's a little dirtier than what me and fletcher are used to in this pond so hopefully the fish are still gonna bite good one of the first challenges we filmed out here was un real i mean it, insane it, yeah we were freaking out and one I, of the best like <laughs> hour stretches of fishing we've ever had yeah it was unbelievable so 
Yeah, we're gonna start off with this square bill, so I'm gonna go ahead and tie it on and uh, see where we go from there. While Noah has a whole box of stuff, I have one uh, little hand-me-down plastic bag of baits with just a little variety pack. This is the, uh, the poverty tackle box. We got ourselves a nice thunder cricket for cheap, and we're gonna see if we can't catch a fish with it. All right, Fletch. I, I think it's only fair for me to wait for you to tie on, and then we're just going to jump right into it, man. Got it all tied up, and we're actually going to spice this thing up with one of our trailers a little bit. This doesn't count as two fish for two different baits. We're going to actually have to catch a fish with this individually, unfortunately, but it will definitely help us catch a fish on this little chatter donk. Slip her right on there. And we are rigged and ready to go, fellas. All right, brother. So this is how this is going to work. It's first part of the contest, Fletcher. We got to catch a fish on each of the five baits. First person to do that gets a point. After that, we're going to move to the sudden death round. 30 minutes on the clock. The person that catches the biggest gets a point. The person that catches the most gets a point. So what you're telling me is I'm about to get all three points. I want to see it, Fletch. I guess we'll <laughs> see it, but the challenge starts right now, baby. All right. Come on, fishy. I'm excited, man. I just want a good old crankfish bite. Oh, fish number one. Gotta get in the boat. Yeah, that's an absolute donkosaurus. One bait down, guys. Chatter don't going to work. That's one of the smallest fish we caught out of here recently, ain't it? They're usually not that small. The big ones are coming. I'm just gonna switch over to the 1.5. Same bait Noah has on, just to show him that I'm better than him. Just wait, Fletch. I won't get him. Just give, give me a moment. Dude, you were like not even in a crevice on that fish too. You were right up. I don't know if you noticed that. You were right on the edge of a tree, but it, it was, he bit it like near the boat. If you, don't, if you haven't figured out, I'm studying what you're doing. So I'm, I'm paying oh my, attention my to one, every- My really established pattern off of the fish. Yeah. Dude, you just gotta cast over here. Dude, I'm, I'm gonna tell you, you know what's funny is you're gonna get hit. Ooh, or I get hit, baby. Oh. Or I get hit, baby. Oh, yes, sir. That's a decent fish, too. Come on, boy. Oh, yeah, that's a good two and a two pounder right there. Flop off. I got that old treble hook, man. I don't know if she's gonna do it. Yes, sir. A little old two pounder yonder. We are tied one and one, and the fish seem like they're biting, so this is gonna be. A fun day. Thank you, baby. All right, boys. Well, we got the 1.5 out of the way. Fletcher's throwing his 1.5. We got to bite pretty quick. So that kind of worries me because Fletcher's just going to be cooking here. But I think for the second bait, I'm going to rock with the dang spinner bait. All right, boys. Well, we got the old spinner bait with a trailer hook. We got to be careful with that trailer hook because we don't want to hook one of these trees. But old spinner bait should get slammed. Last time I threw a spinner bait, Fletch, I caught a 10 pounder now. Oh, okay. So, I'm just saying, last time I threw a spinnerbait. It's like I love getting spinnerbaits up on that cover and hitting off the br branches, but then you get hung up like that, you know? <laughs> I was just speaking it into existence. You got a tree pounder this time. You know what's funny? I was going to say, I was Yeah! <laughs> oh, come here. That's come here, finish. pretty little lady. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, she ain't hooked great. Get her in the boat. Dang, boy. <laughs> well, Fletcher's ahead right here. You know, we're gonna take our time, get our oh fish God. off, just kind of drift in here for Noah. <laughs> Thank you for the bite, honey. We just kind of burnt our good baits. Actually, we got we got one more little paddle tail guy that I think is gonna be money. Oh boy, I don't want to get behind, man. I really don't. If these challenges repeat themselves, you usually win the first one and I end up coming in clutch and winning the last two. So I guess we'll see what happens here. Okay guys, we got bait number three. That's our little paddle tail on our jig head. And I think this should have no problem getting smoked based off of the success of the first two lures. Similar profile, similar fishing style, just kind of cranking middle of the water column, trying to get those fish that are chasing bait. This is the perfect little snack size for a bass that's looking for a munch. Dude, that swim bait should get clapped. I ain't gonna lie. All right, come on, fish. I need something. I want to even up the playing field here. Oh, let's go. No, no way. Let's go. Oh fish. Gosh, a good one too. Number three. Way Stay yet. on. Stay on. She was off the bank too. Don't spit it, honey. 
Don't spin it. Spinners or quitters. Oh, it snapped off. No way. Oh, Fletcher. I got a good one too. Yeah. Oh, yes. I, I think I got her on the trailer hook. Stay pin, baby. Oh, it's a freaking oh, nice yeah. one. Come on. Come on. That's fish number three, guys. Noah's on his third. I'm on my fourth. We got to secure this dub in the first quarter. We're going to go switch to our little beetle spin jig. Here we go, boys. Look at that. Look at a little two and a half. Pretty fish. Thank you, baby. I was starting to think, I was like, maybe both of our baits suck or we're just not in the right spot. Yeah. And I guess we weren't in the right spot because we just both got clobbered. You're going beetle spin. I got my beetle spin soft plastic. I was going to put it on the other jig head, but I kind of like the jig head I just had. It's got a little bit more, a little bit more size to it. You know what I'm going with. Chatter, chatter, bait. <laughs> Yes, sir. The old chattered donkey. We're going to put one of these swim baits on the back. Like Fletcher said earlier, we, we're not counting that as that would just be a little crazy. That'd be a little unfair. It'd be overpowered and then we everybody would be doing it every challenge. But I am on to bait number three. Are you on the bait number four? Oh, we're on four. Oh three. my God. Okay. We're closing in. This $25 budget is about to put your booty to shame. Come on. Oh, this chatter donk just feels right. Oh my my skirt fell off. Already? Yeah, and this was the this it isn't even melted off? Yeah, it just totally melted off. It was a little sticky like it was sitting in the sun or something. Yeah, no, that's crazy, bro. Look at how good it looks, guys, without the skirt. It just looks like a regular swim bait. Oh, oh, oh come on. Oh dude, this this the twitch on this is kind of fire. This might a bluegill or a bass? No, it was a bass, dude. It was a bass. I can't really straight reel this thing, so I'm twitching it. And the, the twitch action on it is oh, fire! Oh, oh, yes! Oh, yes! One more bait to go if we get her in. Boom. Dude, I can't believe that. That's actually a good fish, too. That's all it took. That's all it took, folks. Thank you. Oh, 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 you missed one? Get into that prize. Dude, we're, they are biting, bro. They are biting. Come on, fish, please. I'm taking that off, and we are going to actually just throw our crawl onto this jig head because I think that is just a smarter move at this point. Save us some time. Doesn't matter if it's got an eyeball on it. I think I don't think the fish will mind. That was perfect, too. It's like you were unhooking that fish. It was like the last time. You're just not capitalizing on your opportunities, man. The odds are in my favor, though, even if you win this, because this is how everyone's gone about. Oh! oh dude, he was, run he was running at me so hard, bro. Please stay pinned, baby. This is, is our chance. This is number three. Yep, so I'm on bait number four now. Oh, he was barely hooked, too. Thank you, baby. Thank you for staying pinned. Fletcher needs one more bite. I need two. Okay. There we go. I'm hoping this crawl isn't my downfall. I mean, you think this would be a dominant bait, but they've been really liking that like white moving bait. Dude, I can't believe I haven't whipped this out yet. I was kind of saving it, but I gotta Ooh, go ahead. You're going for the two tap. The two tapper, dude. This is Sugar Daddy. Sugar Daddy bring home the prize. You know what I mean? I mean, Sugar Daddy gets all the ladies. So guys, Fletcher needs. Yes! Oh, come on, please. Stay on, please stay come on. on. Please come on. Stay on. Please come on. Oh, please oh, come on. Oh, I thought she came off for a second. She had a nice little jump there. Oh my God, come, thing, on. Dude. come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Boom. Oh. No That's one point for the good guys. Oh, All right, well, I got one point for the good guys. Bad guys got zero points. We're about to go into the speed round. 30 minutes, most fish gets a point, biggest fish gets a point. This is a question for everybody. <laughs> Easy there, did dude. Did you bring a scale? <laughs> I did not. All right, boys, a little change in plans. We don't have a scale, which is just stupid. Um, so what we're going to do, and this is scary for me because I could lose right away. We're going to do the first fish and the most fish. So whoever catches the first one automatically gets a point. So if I catch the first fish, I get right back in the game, level playing field. Whoever catches the most wins. If he catches the first fish, I'm totally knocked out of the challenge. So Woo! that's, dude, that's crazy. I actually <laughs> like that. I could bring home the, the trophy in a matter of seconds, 
or you know we could be racing for the finish line i'm choosing my bait bro i got the chatter donk with the swim bait Ooh, i feel confident listen i can throw that out in the middle i can let it sink i can reel it at the top i can reel it in the middle i can skip it under trees very versatile it's a shad bait it's gonna be money all right dude while you're tying up i'm gonna get our timer ready call me crazy guys but i think i'm gonna start with the little beetle spin soft plastic trailer that was the thing i got the fastest bite on and You're i crazy and i that. really kind of like the action that like erratic darting it's just something different i've never thrown something like that or whatever i've thrown these little trailers it's always been on like a little beetle spin spinner bait but just kind of darting around like that honestly just looked like a snack so I'm thinking the fish are going to like it as well. All right, Fletcher, 30 minutes on the clock. Whoever catches the first fish gets a point. Whoever catches the most fish gets a point and wins the whole thing if I move on to that round. <laughs> yeah. And the 30 minutes starts now. All right, all right. Let's get right in here. Okay. Spun around. I, gotta, I have to catch the first fish, guys. If not, then we're screwed. That was kind of in the front of the boat now. Oh, I got bit, dude. No way. Oh. No, you just missed no, one. No. <laughs> come on, please come back for it. You, I didn't stick him at all. If we both hook a fish at the same time, is it first person to get it to the boat? I guess. First yeah. Hook set. <laughs> um, I mean, the first person to get it to the boat, I would assume. <laughs> this is intense, Fudge. I can't afford to just get I sweet. <laughs> I'm hoping I get this. Sweet. You're not getting sweet, no, baby. You You're not getting sweet, no. baby. <laughs> I literally was fishing where you were fishing too. Come on, come on, catch one, catch one, catch one. Come on, come on, catch one, catch one, catch one. Come on. Oh, oh, I just got a bite. No way. No way. No! Yes! And he's okay. in my hands, boy. It looks like this is gonna come down to the most fish in the next 30 minutes. Snow is ahead, one to zero in that category. We got some time to go. We're we're planning on coming right back in here. Oh my gosh, dude. My heart was racing. I felt her just eat it. And it honestly felt like grass got stuck on my bait, bro. It didn't even feel like a legit bite. It is one to one in point system. Whoever catches Ooh, the most fish. The skirtless chatter? Yes, dude. That's kind of a fire bait. It, it's honestly amazing. I think that's going to be one of my go tos. I can't believe you had a bite when you went. Literally, the second it touched the water, that fish got slurped. There's one. No, it came off. No. Dude, I hadn't missed a fish the whole time. And then instantly just miss two fish right when it comes down to this this segment i'm not stressing yet i'm still in the lead by one fish if i can just catch a couple that would make me feel really good <gasps> how do you miss it and he pulled my dang he, he ate my tail we're not really balling on a budget like fletcher we can actually switch out our swim bait we've had a fish had a bite had a couple bites we gotta lock in here fletcher doesn't have a fish yet and i really want to get ahead of him by two or three fish there. Oh my god, why am I missing fish now? There we go. No god, it's a bluegill! It's a bluegill! Meaty! Fletcher, that's the biggest bluegill I've ever seen. <laughs> Dude, I might bring this thing out to a disc golf course or something. That's what this thing looks like is a dang disc golf. Dude, they're all here. They're, they're stacked, Fletcher. He ate my tail off again. That's what hit me before. Those that, are giant bluegill. Does that count or, or no? I mean, if you're, <laughs> I feel like just straight fishing for them. I, I don't know. I'll count that fish for you though. If you catch a bluegill and it weighs over a pound, it, it qualifies. Well guys, we're switching up swim bait. <laughs> I have plenty of swim baits to use, so I might as well take advantage. Beat up another one? Oh, he plucked my tail off, dude. Same thing. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's, definitely, it's definitely those mega bluegill just coming up and eating it. Oh. Maybe that's what I've been getting dude, hit I by. There we go. Oh, it's gotta be bluegill. bluegill dude. I'm they the gotta thing. be. That's absurd, bro. I don't know. Oh, that's, oh, that's a nice bass. That's nice. Come on, baby, stay pinned. We gotta take the lead here. That's a nice fish. Okay. <laughs> Can't be falling in now. There we go, guys. Fish number two. There we go, there we go. Got one. Sit, be a bass, be a bass, be a bass. a bass. Yeah! Tied it right back up. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Two to two. Two to two. How are we looking on time? We got 22 minutes left. About a third of the way through. I can't believe the fish on this bank and how they're eating. Yes. Oh, no. Up. Do you think it's all bass or it's that probably one more? That one felt like a bass, dude. 
That one has some size to it. Oh! <laughs> dude, no, those are angry bluegill flesh. I promise you those are angry are bluegill. I, bluegill. Dude, they're goliath bluegill. Dude, this little darting bait is really, really saucy. I, I'm, I might start throwing this on a regular basis. Just to mix it up. Kind of crazy, bro. It's kind of fire, dude. It's erratic. It's got like a cool like fall and dart to it. If you had it on the beetle skin, I feel like you'd have less confidence with it because it's kind of hard to move. But yeah. That little jig head, dude. It's... It really opens it up. Stay on. Stay on. Stay on. Oh, no, oh it slammed on it. Slams. Oh, that's fish number three. I gotta Thank catch up true. here. I can't believe this. I would have never thought that that little beetle spin thing is gonna do that much work. <laughs> you're about to get waxed by the I'm, beetle. I'm spin. nervous, dude. I actually am. Like, I know you're only one ahead of me and I can easily get it on this cast, but like, what that thing's producing right now is is, is worrisome for sure. Come on, Bass, please. I gotta tie it up. I... You get one? Oh, oh, it's a good one. one. Fletcher, that's a big one. That's, a that's one. actually a big one, dude. Is that like a five? I, oh, I don't know. Close to four. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, my goodness. Thankfully, we're not doing big. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, that would have been big fish. Close to it, maybe. Oh, my goodness, boys. Well, we are tied up. That fish is almost four pounds. Let's get back in the water. Holy cow. Watch it. This is getting intense, man. I'm not gonna lie. This is insane. I'm, I've never been so pumped. We've been fishing the last couple days. We haven't seen fishing this good. No, not at all. It has been slow, but today the fish had other plans. I feel like we're about to get up on this other bank coming up here, and it's, it's about to it's about to be crazy, man. Where man. this bank cools down is the same side on the yeah, other. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he ate it on the. There it is. <laughs> yeah, baby! He ate it. Oh. How you lost Bro, <laughs> listen, I don't, I don't even want to hear it. I don't even want to hear it. I hope that comes back to my juice. Dude, bad. listen. This is the most suspenseful video I think we've ever filmed. It's way, it's way too... I don't even know the word for it. I like this to go down to the final second. Yes, Dude, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Dude, it right counts! I'm, I'm actually mad on that one. Dude, Dude I don't even want to look at your fish. fish. Like, that just makes me so mad. Alright, I got the lead. Oh my gosh. I've had a good little streak going, boys, but we're not giving up yet. Fletcher's just fighting oh, back one. with the dink. Oh no! Or am I fighting back? Stay pinned, baby. Stay pinned, please, baby. Okay, this is fish number four to tie it up. <laughs> Dude, these are good fish too, man. Like, good two-pounder. Wow. Four to four, Fletch. <laughs> this is coming down to the end. I'm about to give us a little time check here. Oh, are we sub 15? Let's see what we got. We got uh, 12 minutes. 12 minutes, okay. It's cutting Lock down. No one's been able to pull away from the, the pack yet. Come on, fish. Can I get the lead, please? I haven't had the lead since one fish. We've been tied or he right, got it. Yeah. Come on, fishy. Just by my bait. Every time I sing to him, man, is usually usually the wave. Mesmerize the fish with my voice. By my lure. Eh, eh. I like how you went the rock style on that. Yeah. Yes, Dude, yes, up. you just gotta oh. sing to him. Oh, yeah, she's a bass, definitely. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she's a, she's a little thick, a little thick one. Boom. That's the lead. That's the lead. Well, guess what? Not after this cast flush. Thank you, mama. All right, I gotta change swim baits. I gotta make sure I'm on par. That could possibly be costing us bites, so there's no point in risking it. Might as well take 20 seconds out. To rig a new swim bait on. See, that's where you're you're losing time is all that rigging. I don't know, man. I think it might be worth it, especially on this cast watch. 
Oh, right there, didn't even move my bait. Oh, That's God. a nice one. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Fletch! It's actually a big one. <laughs> it's actually a good one. Look at that fish. Yes! Good three pounder, Tie man. Game. Tie ball game. Was it 5-5? Five, five? Uh, that was a good one. Yeah, yes, nice. oh, is that a fish? Or a oh, snag? Yes. Oh no, this that, is not this good. Is my moment. This is not good. I just felt my body thing on it and it was me oh. hearing the sign. I saw you trying to sabotage my fifth fish, Fletch. <laughs> the heck was that? <laughs> that was that was an accident. <laughs> I was not trying to It couldn't have happened at better timing for you, you know. What a coincidence. Sorry, that was roughing the passer. 15 yard penalty. <laughs> repeat of downs. Is that a fifth penalty? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude. What you say, but... We're not deducting any any points. It's a 10 second no fish penalty or no fishing penalty. In a future challenge, if you miss a fish, you have to take a 30 second penalty box uh, violation. Come on. Is that the lead for you? That is the lead. Number six. He's barely hooked, too. That's number six. All right, Fletch. I've been going easy on you. Oh, I'm locking in, bro. You locking in? I actually haven't locked in this whole time. I'm, I'm ready to just slow plow these fish. Plowing them? Slow plow. Is that another one? Yeah, it's a big one. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm locking in. I'm locking in, Fletch. No. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here with all that. These are healthy fish too, man. All right, boys, number seven to five now. I'm locking in. I got the touchdown. I know exactly what they want. It's taking me all day to figure it out, but I know exactly how to run this bait now. Are we on time? Are we, are we sub five minutes yet? Let's see, what do we got? We have five minutes, Fletch. Five minutes, That's plenty of time. Seconds. Plenty of time for a comeback. I just don't know if I'll allow that to happen. I need another fish right here. I feel like I can finally breathe this whole challenge. I'm holding my... What are you up to? Me breath. Yeah, seven to five. Come on, we're probably like three minutes and we're in the tree. That's not what we needed. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We're gonna have to snap that. Yep. Oh my gosh, you're snapping that. Yep. You got, you got a speed hurry, dude. <laughs> we ain't playing any games. We ain't playing in any games. All right, Fletch. I got the, the old Thunder Cricket tied up. Did you just get another one? Yes, I did. There's no time for you to talk right now, Fletch. You got like three minutes. Okay, okay. Okay, dial in, dial in. No explanation to the people. They just want to see you try to tie it up. Attempt. Time is ticking. Maybe I could get like a two for one on a, a single single hook. What if I caught a two-headed bass? If you catch a two-headed bass, I will happily count it as two. <laughs> oh, dude, I just threw that in there and this fry little bait ball started popping. They don't want to eat my chatter. You gotta slow it down, man. I shouldn't be telling you that, but you gotta... I'm talking, I know it's hard to slow down when you're fishing in the last couple minutes. No. Did you get bit? Yeah. Ugh. So what did you do there, Fletch? You slowed it down? <laughs> no, dude, I sped it up. So weird how they're eating it, dude. There we go. Look. There we go. Oh there we go. God. That puts it within one. No what, how much time we got? We got... How much time we got? We got two minutes, bro. Two minutes? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, there goes that fish. One more and it's a tie ball game. And then we can, I can at least push a sudden death round. Oh, bro, oh, shut. Oh, yeah. No, no, dude, it was the angle. <laughs> no. I gotta, straight, I gotta change one bait. I can't, I can't be just playing like that. I've got a lot of bites in the last like five minutes. It's just, I can't get him to eat it dude only if i could just caught the first fish this round come on now yeah you would have put it away man 30 seconds 30 seconds oh no oh no my bait's wrapped up oh, not no. how not how i need to spend my seconds you can tie it you could definitely tie it, eat it. i don't think yeah. you're gonna win i have time for one more cast oh get right up in this little pocket Oh, that was, that was awesome. oh, okay. You can work it in. You can, I can work it in. I catch one that counts. 
I don't think it's gonna happen, man. No. I do not know how I've came behind all three times that we've done it out here. I really don't, but Fletcher, I'll take good it. Good challenge, man. man.